What's up, everybody? Olaf, Tactical Hunter. Uh, gonna do a kind of a different video. Uh, I know yesterday was my first video. I said that this channel is pretty much just gonna be all hunting, fishing, razor, four wheelers, shooting. I mean, you name it, outdoors. But uh, I want to do a quick video on my iPad 12.9 Pro. And the reason why I'm doing it is because all of us outdoorsmen, you know, we gotta have something to shop on, something to work on, play on, whatever. And I mean, my my iPad 12.9 is what I use for everything. It's what I use for the vlogging. It's what I use to edit all the stuff. It's, I mean, my whole life is on that, that iPad. So I wanted to talk about some of the things that I have for it, what's on it, um, some of the, maybe some of the apps I use, and really just some of my favorite things that I've gotten so far. Um, so yeah, we'll just jump right into it. Uh, if you guys got any questions, comments, whatever, leave them in the comments. Make sure you like and subscribe. But without further ado, let's check out what we got. And I'll adjust the camera angle after we kind of go through and you can see the bigger things. So we'll start off with the iPad itself. So it's got a nice big screen. Um, I've got the uh, Under Armour gear, the UAG case for it. This is the Gen 3, by the way, with the uh, for the Apple Pencil 2. It's got the wireless charging on the top. It's just magnet. And uh, really, that's, I think that's my favorite thing about the iPad is the Apple Pencil. It makes my life so much easier. I mean, for, for my work, from my work to just playing around, um, the Apple Pencil 2 is, is the ticket. I uh, don't really know a whole lot of difference in the function between the Apple Pencil 2 and 1. I know that the Apple Pencil 1 had like a screw cap on the back that popped off and then you'd have to plug it into the iPad to charge or plug it in somewhere to charge and this one's obviously wireless and just sits right up there nice. Um, I use LumaVision to, uh, to do my editing. You can get LumaVision in the uh, App Store. Um, I've got another program for my photos and stuff. I mainly downloaded it for my drone initially. And really the whole reason why I bought the iPad to begin with was for the drone. Um, I've got the DJI uh, Mavic Pro 2 Zoom. And um, I actually used that for work. Um, but yeah, I mean the iPad's great. Everything functions great. I've, I'm an Apple fan. Um, one of the things that you guys are going to see, I'm sure I'll catch some crap for. I've been catching crap from all of my Apple haters that I'm friends with, so I'm sure I'll catch it from you guys too. But uh, anyway, so that's it. Um, I'll go through some of the apps here in a few minutes, but we'll, uh, we'll move on to the next thing. So the next thing that we have for the iPad is a case. No, I'm just kidding. Um, is the Apple uh, Magic Keyboard. Now, on mine, I've got this little silicone, um, let's see if I can get this thing off. It's just silicone cover. Um, I like the functions of the keys better without the cover, but I mean, it just, it looks better, and plus, you know, a lot of times when I'm working on my iPad, I'm, I'm eating or, you know, drinking something sticky, what whatever so I mean I it, it doesn't change it a lot but I, I do like it and I mean it looks good it functions fine it just I don't know I don't know how to describe it it's just the buttons I don't know I mean they still feel fine I guess it's just the transition from button to button that's really odd but um I got this from Best Buy I actually ordered this cover from Amazon and it fits in that great. It has a little retaining piece here on the back side. It has some netting. You know, if you had a charger you wanted to equip with it. Um, I, everything I have for the most part is Apple, so I've got thousands of chargers. Um, but yeah, I think the case was like nine, nine or twelve dollars on Amazon. The keypad I got an open box from Best Buy, so it was about 
It was right at ninety dollars, I think it was, and then the cover was only six bucks on Amazon. And, and I'll try to put links to at least the cover and everything in the description. You you can find I'll, I'll put links for the cover and the case in the description. You can find the uh, Magic Keyboard, the Apple Magic Keyboard, on Best Buy's website. Or I mean, I don't know. I can put a link to that too. So next up. We have, and this is where you guys are gonna laugh. Another case, no. Um, this is the Microsoft Art. Uh, it's the Bluetooth mouse. Um, <laughs> and it works great, actually. And with the iPad too, with the new update on the iPad, it allows us to use a mouse now. Um, and the whole reason why I went with the ARC rather than the uh, Apple Mouse is because the ARC, you can actually scroll with it. So to turn it on, that's all you do. But once you got it on, you can scroll with this with the iPad. With the Apple Mouse, everything functions except the scrolling. Now, I'm sure that before too long we will have, or Apple will come out with an update to fix that. And when they do, I'll probably get rid of the Arc and go to the Apple mouse just because I'm, I'm true and true Apple. Um, but for right now, this thing works great. Uh, this case was, I wanna say $8 on Amazon. Again, I'll put a link down for it. It's got a little carabiner on it. I mean, it's a nice rugged case. And, and I mean, same thing with this one. I mean, it's a nice, Road case, the, the zippers feel good. I mean, to be a cheap case, you can't beat it. So, um, next thing we got, and this one's quick and simple. It's just a mouse pad. Um, it's kind of a hard mouse pad. You know, it doesn't, it's not flimsy, because when I'm, now this piece is, and this is actually a wireless charger on this side. So you could plug a uh, micro USB in on this side, and run it to an outlet, and then you can wirelessly charge your phone while you're, you know, playing on the on the iPad. But the reason why I wanted a hard mouse pad is because a lot of times I'm sitting on my couch when I'm doing this at home. Well, this sits just perfect on the armrest and gives you the structure that you need to, you know, maneuver the the mouse around. So, but it. It's worked great, and it was super cheap. I got it from uh, Target, and it, I think it was on the clearance thing. It's made by Black Web, um, but I think I paid like seven dollars for this thing. I mean, with the wireless charger. So I mean, you can't go wrong. It looks cool, functions well, and you get what you want for it. Um, but yeah, Black Web. Last thing that we'll talk about before we get into everything else, and, and I apologize guys, I still have the uh, tags on this because this is the 13.3. Now my iPad is 12.9 inches and it fits in here fine. However, with the Apple Pencil, it's a little tight at the top of the zipper. And if you have anything else in here that's around the same size, like if I wanted to put my um, the mouse in the box, or I'm sorry, in the case with the the cover on it or the case on it, rather, you would not. It it, it doesn't want to close up right. So I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna get the same exact case. So I'm still gonna do the review on it. I'm gonna get the same case, but I'm gonna get the 15 inch instead of the 13.3. But uh. Anyways, this is it's made by Thole. Uh, I got this at Best Buy. It was eighty nine dollars. Uh, the fifteen inch is the same price. Um, it's very very rugged. Um, the zippers feel great. Everything feels great. It's very very well made. I mean, Thole's known. I, I think it's actually pronounced Thule. So I apologize if I butchered that, but I think it is Thule. And uh, but yeah, it's it's made great. And then on the inside, so you have the option, if you have it secured in here, and I'll show you. So when you open it up, you can actually use this thing as a case. You, uh, let me 
if you can see this, and I'll adjust the camera angle just a little bit. So this is the bottom of the of the iPad, you know, the cover, and it sits down in here, and you could just close it right up, zip it up, and you know, go on about your day. But it fits in there fine. Like, I mean, I'll, I'll show you. If you look right here, it starts to get a little tight. It, it closes fine, but if you have anything else in there, it just makes it a little tough. But yeah, so, you know, lift this up, that up, and then you can use it just like a laptop if you wanted to. Um, in here, in this pocket, well, first of all, you've got a little pocket here right above where the back of the iPad would sit that you could put, you know, your uh, keyboard or, you know, it goes, it's the full depth of it. So if you had like another small tablet or, or whatever in there, you could, you could use it. Now inside of here, you've got a little pocket here where I will probably have my mouse. Um, you also have another little stretch pocket here with the, uh, with the webbing. Um, to put you know chargers or uh, for me I'll put my uh, Wi-Fi little hotspot in there um, so that'll probably slide down in there and then you have a bigger pocket here which is probably where I'll put the keyboard and any extra um, chargers or you know whatever whatever I might need now if you see here, you got places for your pens, and you can also place something here, like this in between here is where I'll probably put the uh, the mouse pad on the go. But uh, really, really, really nice case. Um, very strong, sturdy. It's, it's well built, like I say, and it's just, it's smart how they have everything laid out. It, it's perfect for on the go. And it, it's not real thick, like it's very, I mean, as you can see, it's it's not thick at all so it's not going to take up a lot of room but yet it's also going to keep your stuff protected and keep it organized so that's pretty much it on that again I can't stress enough if you have an iPad Pro and you don't have an Apple Pencil I really don't know what you're doing I mean my Apple Pencil I, I use it for everything. Like I, when I get emails from people that I have to, you know, sign sign off on something and send it back, it, it's so easy. I no longer have to print it out, sign it, fax it in, or scan it to myself and then email it out. I literally just screenshot it, sign it, and email it out. Or you know, and and I mean not just that. Just taking quick notes. You just tap on the screen. It goes. I mean, it, it's quick. It's it looks great. And then if you don't have anything going on, download Netflix, sit around. I mean, I don't know, all in all, if, if you're in any sort of management position and you don't have one, I'm telling you from personal experience, it has made my life 10,000 times easier and I do not know how I went without it. And plus I do all my YouTube stuff on here. I'm constantly watching YouTubes and reviews of different things, you know, suppressors, different guns, um, I mean everything. How to's on putting stuff on my razor. I mean you name it, I look it up, watch it. I do everything on this thing. I, I've completely converted to this other than, you know, I have a three monitor set up in my office, but outside of my office, everything is done through here. I mean I have a company provided laptop and I hate it now that I use this all the time. It's just makes life so much easier. And I also have a, uh, a Zag um, protective glass on there as well and when I put the case on I don't know if the tolerances on this case are just so tight it actually popped the corner of my protective glass which I mean it's fine they they sent me another one and I put it on and everything seems to be fine so I mean they still buy their warranty can't be mad at that but uh make sure you guys like and subscribe there'll be more stuff coming um got some giveaways that i'll be announcing when i'm gonna do an edc dump probably when i get back from my business trip and as soon as i do that when i do my my pocket dump i'm gonna announce the uh 
announce the giveaway, what I'm going to be giving away, and, and what mark I want to meet before we do the giveaway. So, anyways, all right, guys.